How's it going? Nice to see you from a... Isn't it a beautiful part of the world? If you're ever on the Isle of Wight and you want to look me up and go for a beach walk, there you go. The offer's always open. Anyway, back for another beach talk. Thanks for joining me as always. Now, as a CEO, there's one question that you should always remember or keep in your back pocket when you are presented with a set of numbers or a report or a forecast, and that is, is that right? And I'll tell you why. It's a personal favor for me. It's not confrontational. It actually will probably help think you think and whoever's presenting the numbers to you to also think as to think so. But at least it's engaging and both sides can just get to the right answer. Sometimes the first draft from someone who pr produced a lot of spreadsheets, sometimes this is a, a collaborative process. That's what I've mentioned many times before. So is that right is a great question to keep it all, all flowing. The second thing is there are things that you do not want to say. And number one is, that is wrong. Unless you are absolutely definitively sure that that is wrong, just bear in mind that that is it's not, a great, not a great thing to say back to somebody who's presented a set of numbers to you. It might be wrong, but you feel, by saying it, that the other person's now just put on the defensive might start thinking you're a bit of a dick. Now, my personal favourite, this was 15 years ago, there was a chap which his default answer, he would just look at a forecast. I would say within five seconds would say, well, that's just complete bullshit. And I'd be like, you haven't even looked at it. We haven't even talked about it. We haven't talked about the assumptions. And I had no idea what he was looking at. But it inspired me to actually think, how do CEOs think when you see something? How do they react? What are they looking at? Because I need to learn what they're looking at. Maybe I'm missing something. But I always just joke with a friend who we, two of us used to present these numbers just to be met with a continuous, well, that's complete bullshit. Be left asking, well, well, what is the right answer? So collaboration is always something that I really push, I really enjoy. It's how I work with CEOs and bookkeepers and people within, within an organization. You just want to keep the wheels turning of that conversation. And just bear in mind that normally the first forecast isn't right, or the first model isn't right, but at least it gets you moving through the process to something that is robust and credible, and you're going to make a decision on. So, give it a go. I'd love to hear your reaction, and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers for now.